Every rider has things they want to improve on, no matter what level they are. These might be bad habits that have been pointed out to them, but once you've become aware of it, you then need to force yourself to break those habits and make it part of your subconscious. So I do this through visualisation and mental repetition. So I will actively break down the things that I'm trying to improve on and then visualise it in my head, in my downtime. So that might be when I'm driving in the car, it might be when I'm getting my bike ready in the car park, or it'll be when I'm pedalling along the fire roads. So the key is to get all of these techniques drummed into your subconscious and your muscle memory so that if you're tackling a feature that you do find difficult, you can concentrate on the specific techniques that you need for that feature. The things that these are generally useful for and that are on my own personal list are reminding myself to always look up, keep my chin up and looking straight ahead, not falling back into the habit of looking down at the path in front of me. I also need to remind myself to pedal in smooth circles instead of forcing and slamming that pedal down from the top each time. And finally, remembering to keep a central body position because if I do go into features that I'm worried about, it's so easy to slip back and then I have no room for error. So if I always have a central body position, then I'm pretty much ready for anything that the terrain's gonna throw at me. These are things that I need to do whenever I'm riding my bike for the whole ride from beginning, middle to end. I guess the key is reminding yourself to remind yourself until it becomes part of your subconscious.